No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> hey everyone, I hope you're all doing well. Um, just goofing off there because it's kind of bored. You know, we're all kind of stuck in the house um, during this whole quarantine situation. But fortunately, I still have commercial work that I'm doing. So, I mean, I guess that's a good thing, but because um, I do commercial work for this company called AJT Supplies and I just build video content for them, but they're still going, so that means I'm still going. But I don't have my rest of my team with me, so it's just me and we're keeping our distance from each other. But besides that, if I'm not filming with them, I'm actually sitting here at home either editing or I'm gonna give you a list of things that I usually do. I usually read a book, I'll do my morning workouts, and I'll do yoga. With the yoga, I do meditation too, because we're all in this together. And it's a very tough situation and it just sucks. Because, you know, I wanna see my friends and you know, I, I know you guys wanna see your friends too and it's just, it's just, it's hard. Because we have never expected anything like this. We never been through anything like this ever as a country, as a humans, you know, I mean, it's just tough. And, you know, we just gotta keep fighting and keep believing that we can make a difference, you know? You know, going to the grocery stores, you know, and there are lines, you know, you're standing six feet away from each other, you know? We should give each other space, we should have been doing that anyways, but it just feels different. It doesn't feel the same. When I'm going there to pick up water or anything I need around in my apartment, it just doesn't feel the same, you know? Um, you know, there's a glass right in front of them, and, you know, it just feels, you know, I, I just feel sad, you know? I don't feel, I don't feel right, I don't feel normal, you know, it, it's just, it really upsets me a lot, you know, because, you know, unfortunately, you know, I lost a lot of weddings, you know, this year, you know, my wedding season was supposed to start this month, and I lost at least 15, I mean, clearly not 15 for the month, because I usually get them on the weekends, but, you know, they just had to reschedule and cancel all the way up until October. You know, and it just—it's a different situation that I'm, I'm living in. I never, never had this. I, you know, you know, I'm always used to filming weddings on the weekends, and now that's not really taking play anymore. And I got to figure out what else to do. And what else to do is try to build up my, um, my commercial end of it, and, um, and have that as an income of access. I feel like I have to start from the beginning right now. You know, I just start all over with my weddings. You know, I might have to. You know, I, let's use this for a situation. You're somebody that's probably maybe in their second year. I'm in my third year, so maybe you're in your second year. And, um, you know, again, this is what we have to do. We have to hustle, so we have to start over again, pretty much. So, um, again, if you're having a hard time with this, and uh, you don't, you're like, man, you know, my highlight films are, for example, $3,000. Well, I can't get a $3,000 gig right now. But I said, if you can't get a gig right now, and you want, you really want to do a wedding, get down to $1,500. Get that to 1250 or, or whatever, you know? I mean, because we're all strapped for money right now. We're all in the same boat. I think that's what's so different about this right now. We're all in the same situation together, you know? And I don't feel nervous. I don't feel upset. I just feel kind of bummed out because I can't do what I want to do. I can't go out and meet people. I can't do things that, you know, shake somebody's hand. You know, I, I can't do that right now. That's the only part that I'm bummed out about. But besides that, I'm not stressing about money or anything because we're all in the same boat together. You ain't wealthy until you have something that money can't buy. See, money should be controlling our lives, and I think that's what it's been doing for all of us, you know? We're all working so many jobs, this and the other thing, and we don't have time for ourselves. We can't sit down and look each other in the eye and say, I love you, and I want to spend some time with you, instead of, you know, we gotta do this, we gotta do this, we gotta bring in this, you know, this is 4000 this is 3000 this is $30,000, you know, this and then the other thing, and the debt stop piling up, and then we, then we get stressed. But if you realize right now, everything's on hold. Rents are mostly on hold, your phone bills are on hold, your car payments are mostly on hold, everything is paused. So we can just breathe, and we can just realize what we have done, and what can we do to make a difference. So that's all I just wanted to say for today. I'm going to just leave, leave you with this. Thank you for watching my channel and I appreciate it so much. I love each and every one of you that clicks on this video and views, views it. You don't have to give it a thumbs up, you can give it a thumbs down, it doesn't matter. I appreciate it with all my heart. Please feel free to leave a comment if you like and just, yeah, just say hi so I know you're watching. Have a great rest of your night.
or a day. Depends what time you're watching this. Goodbye.